Yo, good morning everybody. Captain Banana here. It's, uh, I don't know. It's early. 6.54 a.m. Uh, local time. It's Indiana time. Uh, 7.54 my home time. You know, Eastern Standard Daylight uh, Eastern time, I don't know, daylight stains time, standard time, I, I can't keep track of it. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, uh, I always look like this when I wake up in the morning. Ugh. So, I think I want to get up before his screaming Mimi alarm clock goes off. The thing's loud, but. I can sleep through the first part of it, but, you know, it's got like a 15 minute warning or 10 minute warning, and then it goes off, and he says it goes off louder, I haven't heard it, because he usually gets up and shuts it off, uh, and it goes off with the 10 minute warning thing, you know, screaming Mimi, it's a trucker's alarm clock, I don't know, supposedly it can wake the dead. I've never heard it when uh, the you know, full wake up phase, so I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to go into the truck stop, use the bathroom, brush my teeth, give me another cup of coffee, you know, do my wake up routine, and I don't know, I record a video. I'm too tired to make a coherent sentence. Uh, I'll shout at you at the next video. Well, good morning, everybody. I just uh, brushed my teeth, washed my face. It's 7:17 uh, local time. Uh, it rained last night, so twisted these trucks a little bit cleaner than it was. Still needs to be truck washed, but the better side of it. Yeah, the good Lord hit it with a power washer last night. It rained pretty hard. But, uh, yeah, I'm at the pilot. I wish I got that. Uh, there was a white long nose Kenworth, all custom. Sitting right next to where that truck was. And, uh, Oh, it was beautiful. Had an air ride suspension. Sat, uh, the guy had it sitting right down on the frame when he was parked. Wheels were tucked in. It was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. Extended frame. I mean, it was a uh, total custom job. Dude spent a lot of money on it. Anyway, um, we're going to go kick Twisted out of the bunk. Wake him up. Get ready to start our day. I have no idea what time the trailer shop opens, but that's the one thing that's it's weird out here. I mean, I'm from the East Coast. The sunrise is early. It's uh, it's quarter after seven, and you know, it's cloudy, but it's not that bright out either. Anyhow, I'll shout at you with the next video. That's one of the brake chambers. The black thing right there, that's a brake chamber. Those U-bolt things, well, they're U-bolts. That's an airbag. There's a shock absorber. That's your uh, brake drum. That's the APU kicking on. It's all the power unit. That's your drive axle. Your U joint. Nothing, uh, no debris in there. The catwalk. Stairs are on the other side. It's your sliding fifth wheel. 
this here is your locking pin that's uh, in there. Your air hose. Another brake chamber. Another airbag, shock absorber. Yeah, somebody bent that frame. That's what happens when you uh, don't lower your air suspension and just slam it under the trailer and kind of mess it up. This thing right here, that's your torsion arm. That keeps it from twisting when you uh, give it gas or, well, in this case, diesel. Another shock absorber. These are your brake drums, and inside the drum, this thing here, uh, you see it? That's your brake lining. So you got to make sure they're not uh, cracked or worn dangerously thin. If they're worn dangerously thin, your tractor's not going to stop. Tread depth must be uh, no less than two thirty seconds of an inch. Make sure all hub seals are good, there's no rust trails, no cracks around the bolt holes, nothing leaking there, tires in good shape. Cap. These are your steer tires. You got to make sure that the tread depth on them is no less than 430 seconds of an inch, twice the depth of your drive tires. No rust trails or white powder residue around the uh, lugs, cracks, pump seals. Looks like it's in good shape. front of the truck this thing here this black thing on the front of it that's a deer guard that uh, keeps the radiator from getting damaged uh, when you hit a deer it's not if you'll hit a deer it's when you'll hit a deer hub seals not leaking all the lug nuts are properly uh, secured no cracks around the rim Tread depth is at least 430 seconds of an inch. That stuff looks good. Alright, so it's uh, uh it's 7.47. I wake up early. Uh Twisted's still sleeping. So I asked him if he was gonna get up, he said no, so you know, I don't want to disturb him. I mean he needs his beauty sleep. He really needs his beauty sleep. <laughs> Nah, just mess with him. He's a good dude. Uh, so I'm just gonna kick around the, uh, well, kick around the store. Try not to spend any. Well, I won't try not to spend any money. I won't spend any money. I, you know, that's the one thing when you're uh, PSD. I mean, yeah, they'll loan you two hundred dollars, but that's for food, not to, you know, buy a super trucker headset or anything stupid like that. You know, you don't need to be wasting your money on that. That's what uh, TNT phase is for when you uh, actually start earning a paycheck. So, now I want to get me a yellow truck like that and have purple letters on it that says Captain Banana. That's a, uh, I don't know what year it is. Maybe it's a 2015, maybe it's not, but. That's a Volvo with a big old sleeper on it. How about you are? Hey, what's going on, buddy? Well, I, uh, I like that color scheme. It look good with purple on it that says Captain Banana. <laughs> or you can get a purple with yellow that says Captain Banana. But, uh, yeah, 
I do like that color scheme. And he's got, uh, oh man, he's got a real big deer guard on that thing. Yeah, that is sharp. That is really sharp. Now I'm inside the truck stop. And uh, all my friends that know me, now there's the CV section. I'm like a kid in a candy store. I could spend a fortune in this place. I mean, anything you need for CB radios, with the exception of linear amplifiers. I haven't seen anybody selling them, but they're illegal, but <laughs> they still sell them. You got all your chrome, chrome accessories. Lug nut covers. <laughs> They're not chrome, though. They're plastic. But yeah, they got uh, they got all kinds of neat stuff in here. All right, folks, we're uh, off to go get a trailer and uh, another job, and uh, get this video in before the uh, we go on duty, and I have to put the phone away. So I will uh, actually the truck is running right now. Give you a shot with the. Uh, at the next location. Okay, so we're uh, at our uh, trailer pickup point. Just loaded our trailer. Got it on there. Yeah, well, I'll do one. Uh, do a better video. We got an older trailer. It's our please support our troops trailer. Prime refrigerated. He's uh, pre tripping the trailer. It's, uh, you know, it's got a nice little scratch in it there. ABS light is not lit. Marker lights. Indicated. Uh, it was dirty on the inside. The marker lights at the top are working. We got our load assignment. Looks like we're not going back to Pittston. <laughs> not going back to Pittston anytime soon. We going to Kentucky. Kentucky. Oh, give me some Kentucky Fried Chicken in Kentucky. Yep, we're going to Walton, Kentucky. I never been there. So that'll be uh, another. Uh, thumbtack in the map of the United States. This will be an interesting trip. All right, so we're uh, in Kentucky at the uh, Blue Beacon truck wash, getting the truck washed out before we go on over to our pickup and uh, get it all, uh, get the trailer loaded. I drove all the way here too. Well, we got a trailer, so we got a trailer, Captain Banana drives it. All right, so we got the trailer washed out and uh, we got to uh, get it cooled down to minus 10. Yeah, so it's gonna be a while. So we're uh, over here at the pilot and a couple slices of pilot pizza, pepperoni, yeah. And uh, we're taking our 30 minute break. 
Wait for the trailer to cool. And we'll be underway. So we're at the ice cream place picking up our load. I, uh, I backed into the other spot, dropped the trailer, uh, pulled out with a bobtail, swung under to uh, get her new trailer. He was supposed to be filming. I did a beautiful job getting under it, getting it all in, did it perfectly. He forgot to hit record. Ah well, there's always next time. Anyway, we got our trailer and uh, we'll be off and running. Okay, so we uh, stopped at our fueling point in Jeffersonville, Ohio. We're uh, filling up the truck and then we're continuing on to Pittston, Pennsylvania. And uh, things are going great. I'm having a blast out here. <laughs> I'm having a ball. And these are some scumbag. Uh, truckers that do this stuff I mean there's a trash can right there there's a bathroom inside somebody's got to leave a bottle of pee on top of the gas pump that is just freaking foul all right folks Captain Banana here this is the end of a very long long day ran my clock out wearing some I don't even know where the hell we are. Some hole in the wall truck stop. Uh, Twisted had to back the truck in because <laughs> parking was just, there There was no way in hell I was going to be able to park there. I mean, he fought with it. He got him. So he, he got the truck in there. But uh, it's been a long day. I'm exhausted. He's exhausted. We're both crashing out and going to sleep. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow.